Hey Tim, Dan Johnson here, president of Wisconsin Lutheran College. I want you to know how much all of us at WLC are looking forward to honoring you with our fourth Divine Servant Award on June 4th. Our first recipient was President George W. Bush, followed by Tony Dungy and David Green from Hobby Lobby, and here we are. We are so grateful that you're joining us with this special night as we celebrate Christian servant leadership. And I thought I'd take a few moments to tell you about our higher educational ministry while also giving you a better visual tour of our campus. Back in the early 1970s, a group of men and women believed that this community needed a Christian college that would prepare men and women for lives of Christian leadership, ultimately impacting and influencing their workplaces and communities and churches and families. And so WLC humbly launched in 1973 as a two-year college and became a four-year college in 1987. In 2009, we started an adult and graduate studies program. And just 13 years ago, Tim, we enrolled about 600 students and today we're blessed to serve almost 1,200 students. And as you can see, every step along our journey, God has continued to outdream us all. We're passionate about sending out Christian leaders who will impact our communities in profound ways. We offer 38 majors, and our five largest majors are the following. First is business. I'll tell you, CEOs and business owners just love our graduates. They're, they're ethical, they're hardworking, they're moral Christian leaders. Education. Of special note, we have a, a long history of preparing a large number of urban teachers, making a difference in some of our region's finest urban schools. We have biology, which is the gateway to our pre-med programs and other health-related science careers. We have sports and exercise science. It's much desired by our students, and it's an ever-growing field. And then there's nursing. We launched our nursing program in 2008, and this booming major prepares exceptional nurses who serve with the heart of Jesus. About one third of our students are pursuing majors in the health and life sciences. And our location could not be more strategic as right across the street is the Milwaukee Regional Medical Center. It's our region's healthcare epicenter. And yet within the context of a vibrant academic program, our students engage in the arts from the visual arts to the performing arts in our beautiful center for arts and performance. And whether it be in the choir or band or on stage in our theater or in the art studio, our students love the arts. Students can study in our beautiful Schwann Library. They can reside in our nationally recognized residence halls, from Steinmeck Hall to Fisher Hall to Aspire. And they learn in our state-of-the-art science building known as Generac Hall. Furthermore, more than 45% of our undergraduate students participate in one of our 19 Division III athletic teams, certainly one of many integral components for equipping competitive and successful leaders. About a mile from our campus is our outdoor athletic complex, home to Warrior football at Robbie Stadium, Warrior softball and baseball at Newman Family Fields, and men's and women's soccer and track and field. And normally our Divine Servant Award celebration would take place in the Time of Grace Center, the home of our basketball and volleyball teams. However, due to capacity issues related to COVID-19, we're hosting our fantastic night in a huge tripped out tent at our outdoor athletic center. God has richly blessed WLC with beautiful spaces and yet the most important symbol that we have on our campus that speaks to the heart of this college is our divine servant statue prominently located in our quad. It's a visual image of Jesus washing his disciples' feet. Our students literally pass it by hundreds of times within their years at WLC. In fact, we, we march our graduates past it one last time on their way to commencement because we want our graduates to forever know this, that our true purpose in life is to love God and to love others through bold and humble Christian servant leadership. And so that brings us to this event, our Divine Servant Award. When we contemplated on who would be our fourth recipient, all roads led to you, Tim. We simply want to thank God and celebrate your remarkable life as a successful Christian servant leader who's so unapologetic about letting your faith in God shine in everything that you do. It's going to be an awesome evening, a celebration of your Christian witness while also celebrating Christian servant leadership as we generate financial support for Wisconsin Lutheran College and our distinctive mission. Tim, I look forward to seeing you on June 4th. It's my hope that this video gives you a better understanding of our cause and helps you to get a feel for our campus and perhaps provides you with a better understanding of the impetus behind our Divine Servant Award celebration. So travel safe, Tim, and we'll see you soon. God bless.